As part of our Founders Day celebration, we and other Nexstar employees in each of our 60 plus markets are going back to our community roots. It's our way of saying thank you to the many organizations who work tirelessly every day to make a difference in the lives of people and communities across this great country. When I started the company almost 20 years ago, we started with one television station serving one marketplace. We have now grown to a company with over 100 television stations serving over 60 markets and a corporate employee base of over 4,500 employees. I wanted to celebrate that growth and our 20th anniversary on June the 17th by giving back to the communities that have helped build this company. Here in the Tri-State, we've selected two organizations where our employees will be lending a helping hand on June 17th. House of Bread and Peace. Every night in the Evansville, Indiana area alone, more than 400 individuals find themselves without a place to call home. One third of these are children. The House of Bread and Peace is a shelter for women and women with children. Since opening in 1986, it's provided a home-like environment in which hundreds of homeless women and children have been able to heal from the wounds of homelessness. The St. Vincent Center for Children and Families. Founded on the values of the Daughters of Charity, St. Vincent Center for Children and Families is an accredited early childhood education and care center that starts all children on a pathway to lifetime success and coordinates programs and services to help families thrive. Our day of caring efforts started on Wednesday, June 15th with a story and message from our president and CEO, Perry Sook, on our 10 p.m. news. We set a goal of 20,000 hours of community service, and the company will support that by giving every employee that registers five paid hours of time off to do service in the local communities. And our website went live with information regarding the day of caring. Our coverage continued on Thursday with in-depth interviews in our 9 p.m. news with both organizations that we helped. Our day of caring started at 8 a.m. with volunteers from the station working at both organizations. Duties and tasks that our employees performed included painting all of the halls at St. Vincent de Paul to give the facility a facelift and in their own words, brighten the atmosphere for the kids who come there every day. At the House of Bread and Peace, our staff did everything from cleaning up the back patio and playground area, mulching, weeding, sorting care packages, and building a new basketball game. In all, WEHT Local had 39 volunteers consisting of employees and their family members who contributed 177 total hours of volunteer time to these organizations. We hope to make this an annual tradition a part of what we do to help our community.